Hello, my name is Terry. This is Pacific Reality Investment. How may I help you? Kindly visit our offices at Ruai Dune Plaza First Floor. You're most welcome. My name is Farson Moredi Kishovi, uh, the CEO of Pacific Reality Investment. Uh, Pacific Reality Investment is a company that deals with construction of affordable housing. Uh, we deal with houses uh, for residential. Uh, and commercial development and most recently we also started uh, doing uh, go downs and churches. Pacific Realty Investment uh, started uh, like six years ago actively. Uh, we had uh, um, a vision to build affordable houses across the country. Currently we do projects in Kenya uh, that is in each and every county in Kenya and then also we have done projects outside Kenya. Uh, our main project being in southern Sudan uh, which we did the uh, last year but this year due to the coronavirus we have not been able to go back to southern sudan again my name is pauline Rivera. Uh, i'm a project manager at pacific reality investment uh, my role here as a project manager is basically handling the client from when they walk into us it's my duty to know the client get to understand their needs and also take them through what we do here at Pacific. Uh, the services that we provide are uh, uh, from uh, design, we design for customers, uh, we give them the costings for their project and then we walk through with our customers whereby we make sure that the customer is part of that project. Uh, we have three categories of finishes, uh, we give what we call standard finishes uh, which we give a rate of 27,500 per square meter, uh, we give uh, another rate for semi-executive finishes that we charge from 29,500 uh, 29, per square meter and then also we do the premium finishes which we categorize in three uh, categories that is bronze uh, that we give at uh, 32,500 per square meter we also give a, a silver package uh, that we do from 40,000 per square meter and then the last is gold uh, 50,000 per square meter I'm Grace Musioka Quantity Surveyor Pacific Real Investment my work is doing variation, cost estimate, and material estimate. By billing the quantities, I mean the cost breakdown of the project. For example, if we, are, we estimate your house as 8 million, I'm breaking down the cost for walling, superstructure, roofing, doors, windows, in that order. But then for projects that are well uh, uh, managed, that the projects that are well uh, when the finances are ready, we always do bank rolls uh, within uh, four months maximum. We do mash on it uh, within a maximum of six months. And then commercial development depends with the scope of work. Welcome to Pacific Reality Investment. My name is Caroline Wanjiko. I am the finance manager. I make payments for materials to make sure they get to site on time. I handle the subcontractors. I receive payments from clients and also handle the payroll. When I started Pacific, we stayed for one good year without even getting a customer, but I was able to persist and uh, persevere with, uh, with the dynamics of the market. Uh, then we got our first customer. The first customer was our turning point. Uh, we did a project, just a small project for one of our clients, and then explained the one out there that the Pacific project I go to deliver uh, within the timelines. And I would say we started getting referrals one by one. And currently we can say we have a lot of work ongoing. We have done a lot of projects in hundreds. The vision that we have is to be doing uh, every year not less than 300 houses because the market for the housing is very high and then also uh, in line with the government uh, agenda 4 we also want to keep on changing our standards in construction industry. I'd like to thank uh, our customers who have been able to trust us with their project. Uh, I would say every year we give out more than 100 houses and uh, as Pacific, we will feel happy when we see those projects outside there. Uh, we also would want to thank our team in the office uh, and then the team which is outside there. We have quite a number of um, uh, employees uh, on those sites so that the work can run smoothly. Uh, we would also want to thank our suppliers uh, for standing with us because without the suppliers, we can be able to uh, actually achieve our goals. And then uh, generally, we also want to thank our families uh, for also giving us that space to be able to serve Kenyans. Thanks a lot.